Okay, so Tusk Act 4 has been re reworked in a universal time. Now, before Tusk Act 4 used to be like a terrible stand, like, it it sucked. Just, it sucked. So, um, I actually already got some stuff. I already got Tusk Act 1. So, uh, how you get Tusk Act 1 is, uh, I don't know why I spawned this now. I got this now, but, yeah, basically... Uh, you know, I'm just gonna speed this up because it's taking me forever to get over there. Okay, so now that I'm actually here, if you head over to the desert area, like, it's, uh, off Italy, just, like, off, it's, it, you'll be able to see it's close. So um, basically, uh, at some point in this little like circle area that I'm circling my mouse around, a uh, like this yellow rock is gonna spawn. And once it spawns, you wanna hurry up and click it. I'm not sure if it has a spawn time or not, but yeah, you just wanna hurry up and click the rock. And then that'll uh, when you're make sure you're standless. But uh, if you're standless, that'll give you Tusk Act One. So then once you get Tusk Act One, you're gonna need to go ahead and wait until you get a Saint's left arm. Uh, That's what the Saint's left arm looks like. So if you see this and you have Tusk Act One, go ahead and pick it up. Or if you're getting trying to get it, just pick it up, you know. And then uh, when you use this on Tusk, it's gonna go ahead and use it. And uh, now you're gonna have Tusk Act 2. It's, you know, not not too much better than Act 1, but it's Tusk. So I'm not gonna showcase all the acts individually. I'm only gonna showcase Act 4. But uh, at the end of the video, I will pop up something saying all the moveset for each act. Okay, so once you have Act 2, to get Act 3, you're actually gonna need to go talk to this NPC next to the Colosseum. So uh, I don't know why I left the Colosseum, so you just want to go back over to the place where you got the rock. Okay, so I think this is the Jesus NPC. Yep. So that was Jesus NPC. You just want to click on him and it's going to go ahead and give you Tusk Act 3. So um, I can't exactly show you how to get Tusk Act 4 yet because I'm going to have to wait for an item spawn. But uh, yes, yeah, uh, I'll, I'll see you later when when that when I get that item. All right, so finally, after taking me a couple of legitimate days, I actually finally was able to get the spin item. So here's my toss right here. So I'm just gonna get on my horse. So uh, so basically, how you evolve into Act Four is you take out your spin item and take it out, and then you need to just run around on your horse. It's literally as simple as it is. You just and then you can press Alt to go fast on your horse. Hold out your spin item, click. No, actually you can't. Yeah, you just have to run around for a little while. That's what I've heard at least. Okay, there we go. So now after running around for a while, I clicked and then it gave me Tusk Act 4. Okay, so for starters, the barrage on Tusk Act 4. So apparently this barrage lasts about 7 seconds. And uh, what's cool about this barrage is that you don't have to be close to them. So look. So how that works is it like, look at that. That is nice. So it, 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 uh, ooh, five second cooldown. That's not bad either. So basically, you sh shoot like some kind of spin item, and then, uh, yeah, and then Tusk goes over there and barrages. So then, uh, also, you can, that's how your, that's how your R punch works. <laughs> Hundred damn Jesus. So you R punch, and uh, you shoot a little spin item, and then you R punch. And then, um, I'm pretty sure this is, this is like the Tusk beatdown version. Yeah, it's like beat down. I love how you can move around while doing moves on Tusk. And in AUT recently, I don't know if it's just in private servers or something, but in AUT recently, the damage has been super good. Like, I've been able to kill bosses super easily. So, uh, G move is Wormhole Barrage. Oh, what did that do? Hold on. Oh, I think I have to aim my, uh, player, uh, aim my Tusk at, uh, someone. Alright. Yeah, I have to aim Tusk at something, and then... It's like another barrage, but yeah, that's nice right there. Good damage too. Oh, wormhole teleportation. All right, let's see. So you press F, and it teleports you. Oh, that's busted. So uh, this T move is called Ari Arigato Gyro. I don't know. I'll try that last. All right. So now if I take a little bit of damage, let me just. Okay. So now that I took some damage. T heals a little bit, not too much, but I mean decent amount. So then your J move is. Apparently, it does a lot of damage. 
Oh, oh, there goes my ult. Well, we'll just test it on a dummy. All right, G. My moves are not working at all. I'm, about, I'm, I'm gonna try to reset and see if that works. So let's try this. Um, let's try the T move again. Nope, still doesn't work. Oh, for some moves, I'm pretty sure I have to have my standoff. No, not T, but for a J move at least, I have to have my standoff. 150? Ooh, not bad at all. Man, that's great. And then, uh, obviously, there is the horse, which I I can't get on my. I have to pull it. Okay, there we go. All right. So, you get infinite rotation when you're on your horse because there was something called infinite rotation blast, and you have to be on your horse to do it. So, here's how it works you press Y, and apparently, it's supposed to do something. So, uh,. Sorry, this showcase is a bit late because, man, it took me forever to get Tusk because I just could not get the spin item. But, you know, we eventually got it. So, uh, yeah, that was the showcase on the uh, moves that I could do. But overall, Tusk seems like a pretty busted stand. So, before we actually, uh, before I end this, I'm going to go ahead and test it on, like, on stuff or Dio or someone. So, here we go. Oh, Dio, okay. Oh, they're both on me. Nice. Man, yeah, I'm dead, dead. There's both of them. Ah! Yeah, I recommend getting Tusk. The transportation on this is great because of the horse. All right, let's see if Infinite Rotation Blast is going to work right here. Yes, it is. 150 damage. That's not bad. That's, oh, oh, burn damage of 100? Woo! Woo! That is overpowered, overpowered. But, you know, I think uh, Infinite Rotation, I think you only get it for... I think you only get it once for life. Not sure. All right, so then uh, next we're just gonna go over the quotes and the pose. That'll be it. So, first quote: You, you can't die if you're in a hole. <laughs> Golden ro rotation energy. You're in the range of my nail bullet. All right, so that's probably all of them. And then lastly, for the pose. That's not the pose. I forgot it's P in this game. Yup, I was expecting it to be this pose. Um, yeah, so Tusk basically just stands on top of you. <laughs> it's pretty funny, actually. So, uh, yeah. Okay, so that's gonna be about it for this video. If you enjoyed, make sure to like and sub. We're just, uh, I'm just a YouTuber trying to grow. My post schedule isn't that great. I'm planning to make it better, though. We're gonna do better. Um, but, but, uh, turn on post notifications if you'd like to see the next time that I post. I actually have a Discord server, link in the description. We're pretty cool there. It's a chill server. But, uh... Yeah, um, see you guys in the next one. Peace and goodbye.